<clears throat> Machines resistant to fire. I thought I said this is where I'd find Poseidon, but the ruins out here are exposed to the elements. But a lot of them are buried in the sand. So maybe Poseidon is underground. If that's true, I might be able to find a way down through one of these structures. Holy crap. All this area to lo look for? Jesus Christ. It's a big area. Poseidon and fishing is. Yep. Definitely. A whole puddle here. There's people in there. Hmm. Tower of Tears. Chest down there. Oh, there's people here. Hold on. Hold the phone. Oh, this is a good one. There's a weapon in that one. Cool. It's been through here. Up, up, up. I was out of I was so close oh, to drowning maybe not not to the embers M Moreland it's over well not for me it's not then you're going to die alone because we're not sticking around to fish out the corpse we're through and so the visionary's fate hung in the balance would he choose life or succumb to deadly delusion <clears throat> hello so there's an ancient city under the sand, but it's flooded. Suddenly, a Nora Spear Maiden appeared. Yeah, okay. Um. Well, you're not typical Delvers. That's for sure. What's this? Uh, I, I call it a diving bubble. This is the Mark I. The Mark II was better, but uh, it got stuck halfway down. Air tube snagged. You went down in that. Yeah, I hardly expect a lay person to understand. Because that's pretty smart. Uh, I'm sorry. May I remind you, you got stuck inside and nearly drowned. It'd have to be portable, though. Mm, machine kneecap, maybe? Well, you'd need a filter. Synthetic membrane would do it. With a hose to a Compressed, compressed air, air capsule, capsule. <laughs> hammer and tongs. What is this? What is happening here? What? Get over here. It's like love at first sight. She's a stranger. You got a name? <laughs> hey, Lord. Moreland. Hi, Moreland. Not a stranger anymore. You're a damn fool. <laughs> Come on. I got the original schematics over here. It's gonna be fun. Oh, um. <sighs> well, hold on. Just a couple of questions first fair enough partner partner Ooh. <laughs> <Don't mind. laughs> so what exactly happened down there it was a delve like no other a chance to follow my old gram's footsteps beneath this structure here is an enormous hollow a dome protected from the sands we built this elevator here to ensure easy egress and exit. It's quite a contraption, actually, and not so easy that- uh, Right. Again. What happened? <laughs> At the bottom, we beheld the treasure my gramps first discovered. Painted images in the air of every description. Mm. Dancing women, and games, and coins, and promises of jackpots. I don't know what that is, but it's gotta be good. <laughs> but then, 
Something went wrong. The images turned nautical. Waves went through them, even fish. It's like a strange underwater dream. Poseidon's dream. Yes. Well. Not the Poseidon suddenly, you're thinking. There's this terrible rushing sound, and then an explosion of water erupted from the floor. Defense mechanism. So water just shot up from the floor and filled the place up? It was a raging flood unlike anything I've seen. We ran like forge fire and barely made it up the elevator as a wave just crashed beneath us. Huh. Shaken, but not stirred. I, I, I built the diving bubbles Mark I and Mark II. Jeez. I tried the descent in each, but I nearly drowned both times. Now that Dunn's beside work. himself. He thinks I'm insane. I can't give up now. I, I, I just, I've come too far. And the embers are just barely within my reach. Well, maybe I can help. Yeah. Maybe you can. As long as it makes me breathe long underwater. What's so important down there that you'd risk your life? Uh, uh well... <clears throat> uh... Moreland, I'm not interested in salvage, okay? Whatever you find below is yours. Well, all right. Then what if I told you we were delving for the most spectacular treasures ever scribed by man or maid? I'd say get to the point. No nonsense. <laughs> I like it. Behold, an ember. Mm, what is that? Looks like a piece of junk. Oh, now, yes, but... But, but, with a proper spark, these magnificent creations of the old ones paint mesmerizing pictures in the air, and the ruins below oh. us are full of them. A feast for the eyes beyond description. Are they memories? This is my old Gramps promised me. Interesting. So these embers project images? Paintings of light. It's amazing stuff. This one showed the most beautiful woman you've ever seen, beckoning all to a buffet of lobster and succulent beefs. I wonder if it was a video <laughs> of the image. I must have watched it about a hundred times as a child in my old Gramps workshop. Hmm. What happened to it? Over time, they die out. Cried the day that this one's light faltered. Oh! But there are many more below, as you'll see if you get down there like I did and my old gramps before me. How did your grandfather discover these embers? He was here, forty odd years ago. He he was one of the first to lead a delving party into the West. He discovered the ancient city around us, plumbed the depths of this very structure. He found the hollow underneath and the glowing embers all about. Took as many as he could and brought them home. He always wanted to come back and get more, but well, never scraped up the shards. What he really wanted to do was use the embers to put on a show, one unlike the world has ever seen. Sounds like quite a guy. He was a true Delver, and a true showman, and I miss him. But I will do him proud. I will gather the embers and put on a spectacle that would have amazed even him. With your help, of course. You guys don't seem like average Delvers. We're not really Delvers at all, we're, we're showmen. Like performers? Showmen. <clears throat> Nora, and thus unfamiliar with the arts. We stage spectacles all around the claim. Stemmer tells stories, which I augment with all manner of sounds and fireworks, and Abadund, he, well. Complains? He handles the money. Uh. Which amounts to about the same thing. When we delve. 
It's to find gear for my theatrics. <clears throat> Which makes this delve the most important one of all. Hmm. How deep is it? Can't I just swim down? Only if you have gills. You can stack 50 kegs in that shaft. Leave it to the Osirum to measure something in kegs. <laughs> Talking liquid depths. I'd say it's apt. After not, sounds too deep to hold my breath. Hence, our new invention. Hope it works. I'd better get after those parts. There's a fully intact compressed air capsule on the Mark II, but like I said, it's stuck in the shaft. If you made it back up alive, I should be able to swim down that far. All right. As for the other parts, Stemmer scouted a herd due south of here that should have what we need. I'm on it. Great. I'll come back when you get the gear. Good hunting. Okay. Oh, diving mask. Okay, I'll do this one first. It's also can I climb up too? Go down first, I guess. Oh, this is uh, wider than I thought. Oh god. Uh, how do I? There we go. Got that is deep. Come on, swim faster. Oh, that must be like a grapple for once. Got the compressed air capsule. Get rid of the water. No, to get all the machine parts. Oh, he sells stuff. Hey. Probably get a. Oh, guess list of 50. <laughs> so, we need at least three dozen kegs. <laughs> Brown ale, maybe. Uh, no, no. For him, scrapper's up. Are you planning a party? Budgeting for Moreland's funeral, thanks to you. I was this close. <sighs> we were going to move on. Leave all this nonsense behind, and you come along uh, and you spark your wet noodle idea. It's It'll be all right. Uh, I've heard that before. All right. So, uh, how does someone like you end up working for someone like Moreland? I work with Moreland. We got three equal claims in this venture. Uh. I saw one of his early shows back when it was just him and his inventions. That belt is holding a lot of belly in for him right now. Works of flame, lights, and shadows, all kinds of gizmos. Never seen the like. But the man is all spectacle. No sense. Bleeds shards like, like, you get the idea. Without me to handle the finances, his dreams would be sunk. More sunk. Uh. Wish we were back in the claim. Plenty of normal shows to do without the the salvage from this blasted place. And yet, you're here, in the middle of the desert, delving for his dream. It was a good one. Uh -huh. Sometimes, a dream has to die. Well... This dream... Mormons. Is going to get him killed. Let's say it Calm doesn't. Down. What happens after he gets the salvage down there? Then we put on the greatest show the world's ever seen. We'll have, we'll have special seating, a premium ale, the works. Moreland will do his his light spectacle thing. And, uh, Stemmer will get their eyes a sparkling with his tails, and I'll be selling tickets. Sound tickets. It's a nice thought, anyway. Uh-uh. Moreland mentioned you were showman. What? An Osram can't be anything other than a, a, a delver, tinker, or drunkard? <laughs> well... Okay, sure, we are delvers, too. But that is not our main source of income. Mostly, we go town to town. Putting on shows. These shows, what are they? What happens at them? Tales and spectacle. Uh, uh, 
Morland's got the technical know-how. Builds uh, all manner of inventions, whirly gigs of, of light and sound, cannons that, that, that shoot fire and showers of sparks and stemmer. Keeps them enthralled. Tales of adventure in the smoothest baritone. Huh. Okay. Yeah. That. <laughs> and you? Me. <clears throat> Who do you think handles the financials for the whole blasted thing? <laughs> those two... Eh, those two might have the, the sparks, but do you think they know their way around shards? <laughs> do they? No, they don't. Hmm. Well... So Moreland was down in this ancient city, and... The three of us went down below. You? I can delve, too. Right. And, uh, then what happened? What do you think? Water rushed in, we ran. And Moreland built that blasted thing. Nearly got himself drowned. Twice. It... You want the finer details of his stupidity? You go ask him. I'll leave you alone. Do us a favor. Leave us all alone. Wow. Rude. Oh, lady. According to Moreland, the herd should be south of here. Alright, let's go get it. Look at this. It's like a little arena. Well, this is where Moreland said the herd would be. They must have moved on. I need to pick up their trail. Better look for tracks. What do we got here? I'm gonna grab this while I'm here. There. Tracks should lead me to the herd. Cool. Over here. Thank. Sunshine fragment. Look at that. Uh, pack's full, but my stash has room. Exactly, am I following? I need. Where are they going? Oh, shoot. It should have fired. Golly. Whipped up a set. More machines. I better deal with them first. Oh, those coming in. A surprise the wrong button go on okay got them all uh, where did the herd go Pretty fast. <clears throat> Just kept on a walking, I guess. Ah, uh, are those fucks? Oh, 
down. down. Okay. Never mind. Don't come down. <laughs> Can't get up to you. Where the heck am I going? Oh, there they go. There they Oh, shit. Flashers, get back. What is this? The flashers in their cargo pods. There's all kinds of goodies in that building, but how do I get in it? Hmm. Oh, probably get in through the metal flower over here. Which <clears throat> I don't have access to right now. I'm sure once I clear that though, then I'll have all kinds of goodies in there. Hello! I just realized there's upstairs. Let me check it out. <laughs> oh yeah, great. Mind if I do. Look at this. An elevator? Built by Moreland, maybe. I thought we were finally going to get away from this works. place. Well, good thing that Aloy showed up. We'll see. The longer their sojourn. Let's what can do I do for you, partner? <laughs> I've got everything I need to build the. Uh, the incredible diving mask. I think diving mask is enough. I won't quibble. The workbench is all yours. Heck yeah, man. That's what they're waiting for. Whoa. There's a marvel. If it works, you'll let me try it? I want to get down there and get those embers. Assuming I don't drown. So what are you really looking for down there? It's hard to explain. Something that caused a malfunction in the apparatus that controls the old city. I think it started the flood. Well, I... I thought we started the flood. Like we sprung a trap. I don't know how we were detected. Like I said, the dancing lights around us changed, turned to sea life. <sighs> there was this flash of red and the roar of water surging in. Wait, a flash of red? A, a red light from a spot uh, near the grate on the floor where the water burst through. It was like a beacon. Ah. Or a morning. Thanks. That might help. I hope it does. And good luck down there. So will I be able to breathe indefinitely now? Okay. I wonder. Time to see if this thing works. <laughs> <laughs> 